All right, we're all the way up to 20 miles per hour, guys. This is exciting. Oh, wow. Now that is sexy, isn't it? <laughs> Look at that airflow. Forward Dynamics offers such benefits as fun economy, better fluid handling. Hey guys, CS here. How's it going? Welcome to the 1987 Ford Simulator. Now, um, as we watch the Ford logo get laser etched into the screen here, uh, I just like to say this is, I believe, the very first game I ever played uh, when I was two years old as a kid. This is an old game, an old ass game, no doubt about it. Uh, basically, it's a gigantic promotion for Ford. You basically get to look at all the different cars that were available in Ford's 1987 lineup, and you can take them for a test drive. You could do a tour, uh, drag strip, slalom, stuff like that. So we're just gonna go into touring, and um, yeah, you have all their different, uh, all the different car models, which are cool. Let's go with the Festiva. And, uh, okay, press I to start the car. God, I have not played this in a long time. Like, literally, probably 20 years. Okay, gotta fasten your safety belt. Good lord, this is damaging my ears already. So, um, how do we get the car going? Uh, what are the controls? Uh, okay. C caps lock accelerates. Okay. Wow. Caps, <laughs> caps lock. Wow, great acceleration key. I can tap quickly on the spacebar to accelerate. Okay, well, let's try that one. Oh, yeah. Okay. Now the car is moving a little. Oh my god, my ears. I really hope that's not going to be super loud on the recording. All right, we're all the way up to 20 miles per hour, guys. This is exciting. Oh, this is so much fun right now. Come on. Can we go higher than 20 miles per hour? Okay, so I just realized there's a, there's a gear shift involved too. You have to press numbers one through five to manually sh if you're if I'm doing the spacebar method. Uh, yeah, that's why. There we go. Now we're up to 60 miles per hour. Okay, let's go to the fourth gear. Woohoo! Here we go. Now we're really driving. This is what driving in 1987 was like, no doubt about it. It wonderful. Uh, what is this? CGA graphics, I think. Yeah, let's kick into fifth gear. <laughs> we are going way over the speed limit right now. Oh crap. Oh crap. I'm going way off the road right now. Good lord. This ah oh, the sound of that engine piercing my eardrums. Oh, oh crap. There's actually no point to this mode. There's like no end. I don't think the road ends. We're going to just have to make this end by pressing F8. There we go. And now we get taken back to the info center, which gives us a little schematic uh, blueprint-like diagram uh, showing you how the underside of the car works, and if you press certain buttons, you can interact with it. Ooh, look at that! There's the front-wheel drive, I think. My head's in front of it. Um, and there's the real-wheel drive. Wow, this is so cool! Alright, All right, let's, let's try the slalom this time. We're going to do the slalom, and we're going to go ahead and select the, uh, what car? I don't know. The Taurus. Why not? Okay. Let's see how we do now. Fasten your acid belt. <laughs> Come on. Good lord. Caps lock for acceleration? That is like the stupidest thing I've ever heard of. Oh crap. Oh, that's the slalom. Okay, I'm supposed to be avoiding those things. Okay, I just realized. Oh, I've run over every single one of them so far. I probably have tons of holes in my tires right now. Why do they have to be spike shaped? Oh crap, what, what, how am I getting, oh, what happened here? I didn't even, oh jeez, oh, this is not good. Can I go the other way? Can I go the wrong way? <laughs> I've never tried to turn around and go the wrong way. Oh, okay, here we go, let's get back on the road. No, I said back on the road. Oh my god, well, at least, <laughs> at least I'm avoiding the, the spikes this way. Okay, I think that sound means that I did something good and actually avoided one of them. Ah, uh, come on, come on, come on, okay. Okay, okay, yeah, I can tell the difference now if I get a dot, if I go over it, and a bleep, if I avoid it, I think. Bleep, 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 bleep. Oh god, the sound of the engine makes me want to kill myself. What, the, what is going on right now? Is my car farting? You know, s screw this. 
Okay, let's, uh, what do we got to look at this time? Oh, the steering. <laughs> Ford's like, yeah, you should uh, take a look at the steering mechanism because clearly you don't know what the hell you're doing. <laughs> take a look at that rack. Press and hold the space bar to see the steering function. Wow. Look at that top-notch 1987 animation, huh? Ooh, hoo, hoo, more schematics. This info, this info center is probably the coolest part of the game. Yeah, wow. Look at that. <laughs> nice dotted lines. Oh yeah, now those tires are pumping. <laughs> I, I don't really know what this is supposed to be demonstrating. Uh, Alright, let's try the XXXR4 Ti. That looks like, sounds like a cool car. But no, let's go, let's go to the info center because the coolest part is actually looking at the schematics. Oh yes, airflow management. <laughs> this is probably the coolest uh, schematic illustration there is here. So hold the spacebar to see the airflow. Oh yes. Oh, you you have to you have to keep holding spacebar. Look at that airflow. <laughs> I remember being mesmerized by this when I was a kid. I just like I would spend hours upon hours just holding the spacebar and watching this amazing animation. That probably explains a lot, doesn't it? I'm sure you guys can read the uh, the text that my head is covering. Ford Hero Dynamics offers such benefits as fine economy, better for the handling, fine for the interior wind noise. <laughs> okay, so let's stop screwing around. Let's go to the Grand Prix already, and let's actually have a proper race against ourselves. Let's let's use the Ranger. Let's start a uh, number of laps, one through five. Uh, let's just do let's do let's do one lap because that's probably gonna take long enough. And they're off. Okay, we're not gonna win the race going at 20 miles per hour. Oh, I like how the, the background is now a city. That's different. Gee, all, all I ever remember seeing is the mountains. Oh crap. Oh crap. Hey, come on. I was I was steering. I was steering. God, once you get up to speed, it is so difficult to control the car. Like, you have to be, you have to have really good reflexes. Okay, okay, 77 is probably a good con consistent speed to stay at. If you drive one little inch onto the checkerboard lawn, you get screwed. Is this lap over yet? Woohoo! Now we are flying! We're gonna get pulled over by the police soon. <laughs> oh yes, going into fifth gear. Can we get 100 miles per hour going here? Oh, we finished the lap. <laughs> oh, yes. Oh, yes. Okay. So, what was my time? Uh, two minutes, uh, 17 seconds. Driver rating hopeful. <laughs> hmm. Now I'm curious to see what other uh, ratings it can give if there's a hopeless rating. <laughs> oh, what do we have here? Independent rear suspension. Okay, what can we look at? Uh, I can't read because my fat head's in the way. Uh, IRS helps provide a smooth, stable ride, more interior or trunk space, and nothing else. There's just <laughs> two benefits, apparently, and gee, I thought the IRS was uh, around to steal your money, primarily. All right, let's take a look at this hot suspension function. Oh, wow, now that is sexy, isn't it? <laughs> look at that sexy suspension. Oh, yes. Parallel four-bar suspension arms. Okay, I'm having... Okay, guys. So that was uh, that. That was Ford Simulator, 1987. Now there were uh, surprisingly, I think about five other games that came after this of the Ford Simulator um, chain, and they're all very similar with some slightly updated graphics. But yeah, this was the very first one and the one I remember most as a kid. So I hope you enjoyed it, and uh, if you did, make sure to leave a like on it. And um, yeah, this is probably the oldest game I'll ever play on the channel. I uh, hope to see you guys next time, and until then, this is CS, signing out. <laughs> I love watching these animations, I really do.